Hi everybody, it's Kenzie Knox and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we'll be doing a nice little painting of a landscape. Um, some trees over here with some water. So we'll be working on some reflections. This is going to be a little bit different of the color in the sky, but let's go ahead and get started. Today I've got a nice little palette here. We've got aqua green, turquoise blue, light permanent blue, sky blue, thalo blue, cadmium yellow medium hue, light blue violet, and titanium white. Add this to your palette. I'm going to start off with our one inch oval knot brush. I'm going to take a little water bottle and squirt it down, some water on there. Then using our one inch oval knot brush, spread that water out. This will really help our paint glide along our canvas. So grabbing some titanium white with some sky blue. We're going to come in here, this cool blue color. And that down just a hair. I'm going to grab some titanium white with some aqua. Go half over the blue and half not over the blue. Got some more aqua. Bring that aqua in there and then bring it down. I'm going to grab some more white on our brush. Go half over and half under. Bring that down. Maybe go a little bit more white up here and just pull that into the turquoise. Grab a little bit more white, pull that down, just blend that in. Get your brush a little bit wet, grab a little bit more white, pull that down, blend that in. Some more white, blend that in. Okay, and then we're gonna get to our little C level. I'm gonna blend this a little bit better up here too. Just go over this area and just blend it in. Okay, so then we're gonna grab some titanium white with light, light permanent blue and mix that together. I'm going to take that and we're going to come back to about right here, paint this across like this. Get your brush a little wet, bring this down a little bit. I'm going to have a little, I'm just going to bring this over, even though there's going to be land here. I'm just going to bring this over just in case. Add a little sky blue to that color and a little aqua, a little more white, and bring that in. A little more white. Get your brush a little bit wet. Grab some more color. Bring that down and across. I'm going to grab a little bit more aqua. Some white. Bring that aqua down into here. Grab some more aqua and white. And then we go back to our titanium white and sky blue color. So I'm going to grab some white with some sky blue. Mix that up and bring that down over here. Get your brush a little bit wet. Just paint that across. Grab some more color. Make some sky blue into here. Okay. Rinse it off. And then I'm going to add a few more colors to our palette. Okay, so I've added raw umber, cadmium orange hue, magenta, and Prussian green. So taking my size, I must say, 12 filbert brush, I'm going to get that wet, tap off the drips, take some titanium white with my raw umber, mix it up to a nice little dirt brown color. I'm going to have this come over this way. And up here. Painting landscapes, it's always important to generally start from the background and move yourself forward. So I'm going to take my size zero silver brush, get that a little wet, and we're going to work on the background trees over here. 
So we're going to take some light blue violet, some titanium white, and some light permanent blue and mix that up. We're going to take that and create some trees back here. And just create a line. And then just tap down some foliage. Different heights, different widths. Coming down to here. You can even carry this line over here. And then we'll do another one right here. Just tap that in. Do a little small one right here. Maybe another small one right here. And then another one right here. And we're going to do a tall one. You don't want these too tall the farther away they are. Generally, the shorter in height they are. And the closer they are to you, the higher they get. So just keep that in mind. And maybe I'll do another mid length tall one. And then definitely we're going to have trees over here, but if you happen to see through them, you're going to see some of this foliage, right? So even if it's a short tree, technically should continue going over. So, let's put these in like this. And maybe I'll just stop right here because maybe this little landline here only goes to over here. Okay, then you rinse your brush out. Do that same filter brush. We'll go back to that titanium white. Raw umber color. I'm going to go over here. Just bring that in, bring that over. Bring that back. In. And then bring that over. How did that come up? Rinse that off. I'm going to taste some Prussian green some yellow and mix that together to get this nice light green here. I'm just going to go over the top here. Add some grass. You can take that Prussian green and just bring that down and over the top area here and down over here. With that Prussian green. Bring that down over here. And set off each filbert brush. We're gonna grab that Prussian green, with some dicing purple, mix that together for a dark green color. We're gonna start with a little tree over here, so this little guy right here. Let's tap him down. That maybe we'll go a little bit higher. Tap this guy in. You bring this one over a little further. Then you can give them spaced out. They don't have to be fully covered foliage trees. And then maybe we'll go higher. Maybe this one needs to be higher. And this one too, just a little bit. These ones are going to go higher to almost the top here. And come out. So it's Prussian green, Diocesan purple. Brush if you need it. And then maybe we'll do another one back here, going like this high. Like I said, they don't have to be full. You can also use a fan brush if you'd like to create some foliage. Or you just continue tapping them in with your filbert brush. Grab some more color. And this one's going to go all the way to the top. OK. 
Okay. And then we can actually maybe add just a little tree over here. We could have some brush over here. That's a little bit higher over here. Just coming down. Maybe another tree over here. Just like this. Maybe the beginning of one over here. But maybe these would go a little bit higher too. Oh, it's pressure green day of bloom. Sorry, I thought it was dark seeing purple. Okay, and then we have another tree back here behind this one. Like that. And this one come up here so you can see a little bit better. And then we could have a little bush over here. We could also have a little bush over in front over here. Maybe a bush coming up over here. You can add some more water to your brush again. Have a nice bush up here. Have a bush in here. Okay, we zoom off. Got some Prussian green. Got some yellow. Into that Prussian green. Take that yellow. Just tap that over here. Add some highlights. And then we're gonna take this yellow, green, Prussian blue, and green color. Come up here. Add some highlights to this tree. Some highlights to this tree. To this tree and this tree. And we're gonna take some yellow blue with some yellow. Or not yellow blue. Um, turquoise blue with green, um, with yellow to make our green color. It makes it a little more opaque. You can see it a little bit better. Add this green over here too. Over here. A little bit over here in this tree too. Over here. And then and this one just comes all the way down. So maybe there's no bush there. Okay, right, there's a bush here. A bush here. I'm gonna taste some aqua with some yellow. Mix that together, it's gonna to be a very bright green. We're just gonna take that. Tap that in. And then take that bright green color. Add it over here. Even a little bit in here. Let's 
Okay, rinse that off. And I'm gonna take some of our, our magenta and add some foliage, so we've got some white, some magenta, a little opacity. And just add that in over here. Then a little bit over here in this bush. Can't okay, rinse it off. I'm gonna take some white. A little bit of white with some orange. Mix that together. Add that over that. A little over here. A little bit over here. Take some more orange, add some yellow into that. A little bit of white. That. I'll go back over this with some color, but for now, take that aqua with yellow color. Maybe add some light permanent blue with some yellow. Okay, you add brighter yellow, brighter green color. I just tap that in. Tap that in where you think you lost some of your highlights here. I'm gonna grab some just yellow. Add some yellow up in these areas. Rinse that off. Grab some orange. Put some orange back in. That's more orange. That's more orange. So I'm gonna grab more yellow. Grab more yellow. Okay, rinse that off. And then we're gonna do a reflections in the water. So we're gonna take that Prussian blue green with that dark with Thala blue. And we're basically gonna come over here, pull this down and sweep. Pull down a tree here. Sweet, pull a tree here. Sweep. Pull a tree down all the way over. Pull a tree down here. Tree out here. Sweet that. Grab some water and brush if you need it. Grab some more color. Pull a tree down here. Sweep this in. And then pull one here. Here. Okay, and then we're going to add some highlight color. So we're going to take some yellow with some aqua, make a nice bright green color. We're just going to pull that over here.
Pull that out over here, pull this out. A little bit here, pull that out. Over here, pull this out. And even in here, but down here. Pull this out. Got some more yellow, some more aqua. Pull this out over here. Okay. Rinse that off. Then we're gonna grab that deep green color again. Pull, 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 sweep. Pull, 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 pull sweep. Just so we know where we're going. And then we're just gonna take some magenta. Try to match it up somewhat with what your little painting looks like. You can rinse that off. Grab some orange. Let it sweep. And we're going to grab some yellow. Oops, that's a lot of yellow. And then we grab a little bit of white, titanium white on the tip of your brush. And just come over here. I'm just going to do the water line right in there. I'm going to taste some light blue, permanent, with some aqua. Let's create some water lines here. Get some more of that color. Grab some more of that green and we can pull that green out too. That green does not need to stick to the template. And grab some more light blue permanent with some more aqua. Just pull that out, rinse that off. Got some titanium white. Let's come over here, grab a little more white. Come over here, grab some more white into that blue and aqua color. We also have to do these trees that take some light blue violet with titanium white. Might be a little bit darker, so we're just gonna pull the sweep. Pull sweep. Grab light blue violet. Okay, rinse that off. Grab some titanium white on the tip of your brush. Just get some more elements in there. Grab some more white.
Hey, we're pretty much done. So thank you so much for watching my YouTube channel. I really appreciate you guys. Please remember to like this video and to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And until next time, I'll catch you guys later. Okay, bye.